boys and girls and welcome to Gordon Guitar. We have Foo Fighters here, nothing at all. All right, so great, another great song from Foo Fighters here. We'll start with the capo set on the third fret. All right, so we have a couple of chords to learn. Let's take a look at the chords. Starting with E minor, that is open E, second A, second D, open G, open B, and open E. Next chord is the D, so that is open D, second G, third B, and second E. We have C next, so that is third on A, second on D, open G, first B, and open E. A minor, so open A, second D, second G, first B, and open E. We have G as well, so that is 3rd on E, 2nd on A, open D, open G, 3rd B, and 3rd E. And we also have the A, so that is open A, 2nd D, 2nd G, 2nd B, and open E. And there we cover the chords we need. Alright, so we'll play the verse now, and with that, E minor is the first chord. Let's take a look at the strumming pattern together. So one round will be down, down, up, down, up. Like this. So down, down, up, down, up. That's one round. Pretty easy, huh? Let's look at the chord progression here. We're going to play two strumming rounds for E minor and then two for D. And then you repeat that for two rounds. So E minor, D, back to E minor, and D. Then we play C2, and A minor 2. And all that is one chord progression round. You're going to play this for two rounds. So just to repeat this, E minor two rounds, D two rounds. Again, E minor two rounds and D two rounds. Then you go to C and play two rounds and A minor two rounds. That is one big chunk and you play that for two rounds in both verses. Then we'll go to the pre-chorus and I can already mention here that the pre-chorus and the chorus is played in the same way. All right. So now it completely changes here the tempo and the strumming so you're gonna have the e minor start here and one strumming around is four downs so that is four rounds four downs you're gonna play e minor one strumming around that means four downs c one strumming around g one and a one so that is the chord progression e minor c g a you play this chord progression for four rounds and it goes pretty fast slowly sounds like this That is your pre-chorus and like I mentioned you're gonna play in the same way in the chorus so you just continue with another four rounds in the chorus and both first and second pre-chorus and both first and second chorus is played for four chord progression rounds so nothing changes there you got just gonna continue from the pre-chorus to chorus and play that so after the second chorus about two minutes and 23 seconds into the song comes a bridge part you're gonna continue the same strum here, down, 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 okay, pretty fast. Now you're gonna play C for four, four rounds, four downs. So, the A minor four. And then comes the final chord, it's E minor. You play that actually for 32 times. It's a very, very long, part there with E minor 
and that you just uh, chew this down but you can also just play one down and try to just end that and kind of ring out with one down uh, in the song here the drum kicks all the way so the beat is there and uh, it's up to you yeah depends on if you're playing in a band or just for yourself or whatever you do uh, if you want to follow that drum and just chewing the E minor or just end with one down and let it ring out but it lasts for 32 strumming rounds away all right so that's a bridge part and then it just ends with a post chorus part you play the same as the choruses or the pre-chorus it's the same you play that for eight rounds instead of four and that ends it all so that pretty much covers foo fighters nothing at all and uh, yeah a great song uh, really uh, challenges uh, your your speed with all the downs and like that but the chords are pretty easy here with the capo on third so give it a try guys good luck if you enjoyed this tutorial please thumb up show me some support here and till next time play tuned